Hi beginners, I am your host Oldie Goldie from Simple Cooking. Our today's recipe is very very easy. These are the nuggets, potato nuggets for fast. So this is fast recipe. We are preparing nuggets for fast. So whatever the ingredients we require, we just go to the kitchen and see. I deep fried it. That's why I uh, take this pan and put the oil in it. The second thing is, this is sugar, this is salt, this is red chili flakes, this is uh, cumin seeds, this is green coriander and this is actually sago flour. I roasted sago in the pan and then I grind it in mixer. So this is only to cover up that potato. Now I boil the potato and grate all these potato. So let's we start our recipe. One, two, little. Then what we do, we add cumin seeds, then this red chili flakes to make it tasty. This is salt, this is sugar to make it crispy and then add a little bit coriander powder. Now what we do, we have to mix it with our hand and let's see what happened because the water in this uh, boiled potato is released immediately when it gets contact with sugar and salt. So we cannot bind these nuggets in a shape whatever we want. So what I do, I use this sago flour to add it. All the ingredients like sago, salt, sugar, cumin seeds and red chili flakes are used in fast recipe. Correct? So only the one thing that is green coriander leaves which I use in my fast. If you don't want to use it, you miss it. You remove it. Uh, uh, don't use it. Okay? So see. We mix it well. Otherwise, it will not bind properly. Now, I start I am preparing only 4 to 5 nuggets to show you how to do it and then I give you the chutney which I prepare. This chutney is roasted peanuts, uh, one green chili, some coriander leaves, sugar, black salt and white, uh, sorry, uh, fresh coconut. Only two to three ingredients, uh, sorry, uh, three to four ingredients I use for this chutney. I will show you chutney. I already prepare it. Now, I use some a little bit oil on this and it will get smooth dough. This dough is not open in this oil. Nuggets are ready. The ingredients which I use in this, these all ingredients are for fast recipe. Uh, sago flour, then uh, uh, this boiled potato, white salt, white sugar, cumin seeds. Only the objection about 
coriander leaves. Some people are not use it. So they remove in this recipe. They don't want to use this. All my nuggets are ready. This is the only one thing. If you want to give like this type of ball, you can make a ball. But I like this. Then it will help to deep fry nicely. Okay. So I put this nuggets into the oil. Now we don't want to touch this. Let's these bubbles cool down. I will show you the chutney which I prepare. This is white chutney. I use uh, one green chili, uh, then uh, coriander leaves, roasted peanuts, a fresh coconut, salt, white salt, white sugar, black salt, and curd so this is my chutney my chutney is ready now we go and see see nuggets are ready these two nuggets i already prepared i hope the gas a nice aroma spread see after uh, uh, getting cool these are little bit crispy from outside Potato nuggets and chutney is ready. Very simple and easy recipe. Now about the sago flour. It is already, uh, means it is available in malls or uh, small shops also. Because now fast uh, rituals, fast religious um, festivals are coming like Navratri and all other. So they require the sabudana flour. Sabudana or sago flour. So you will get it in any mall or any small shop. So you can use only sago flour, boiled potatoes and the chutney. If you don't want to use chutney, without chutney you can eat it very nicely. Yeah. If you like this recipe, then please subscribe, comment to my channel, like to my channel. And give me some uh, reply about this recipe. Because see, potato nuggets uh, when prepared in the hotels or anywhere, they use uh, corn flour to make it crispy. And uh, we eat very hot potato nuggets. So it is always crispy because it is hot. But when it gets cool, it gets a little bit soft. But this, this soft nuggets also very tasty and very delicious. Thanks you watch my recipe. Thanks again.